Hello, in this video I'm gonna show you how to set up your Acer Aspire 3. This tutorial will show you how to set it up on Windows 11. In Win if Windows 10 is installed, then it may differ slightly, uh, but you can follow this tutorial anyway, only the UI elements should be different. So the first thing um, is to turn on your laptop and once that's done select the country or region I'm gonna select United Kingdom and then click on yes now select the input method I'm gonna leave it on United Kingdom and click on yes now it asks you if you want to add a second keyboard layout you can do it by clicking on add layer, but I'm gonna click on skip. Now it asks you to connect to network. Um, on Windows 11 it is mandatory. On Windows 10 you may skip it. So I'm gonna select this network and enter its password. Now let's click on next. Now my laptop has taken a while to install the newest update. Um, it depends, sometimes uh, they are installing, sometimes are not. Um, in this case they are. So after that it will automatically restart so you don't need to do anything. Just wait until the next step uh, shows up. Uh, now it, it will ask you to name your device. You can skip it for now. Now it asks you to sign in and um, on Windows 11 it's also mandatory to sign into the Microsoft account and on Windows 10 you can either uh, log into the Microsoft account or there will be an option uh, I think somewhere here uh, to create a local account so now let's go ahead and log in Uh, now it asks you to create a pin for your account, so let's click on create pin and you can uh, enable or disable include letters and symbols, I'm gonna disable that and just type in the numbers then uh, retype it to confirm Uh, now it asks you if you want to let Microsoft and apps use your location so I'm gonna click on no and then if you want to use find my device send diagnostics to uh, Microsoft improve inking and typing some experiences accept okay Uh, then it asks me to customize my experience, I'm gonna skip that, but you can select what do you do on your laptop or whatever. Then it asks you to use your phone from your PC if you want, I'm gonna skip that. Then it asks me for some backup stuff, I'm gonna click on don't backup my files and next. Then um, for something with Microsoft Edge, so you can also read it and agree or not. Then it asks me for Microsoft 365, I'm gonna decline that. And also asks me for something else, but also the same, so I'm gonna de decline. Then 
next okay and now you're configured that's all for today don't forget to like and subscribe see you next time